hello friends uh, welcome again and this is my new project marriage hall booking system and uh, i have developed this project in python django and mysql the version for the python i am using is the python version 3 and the django version is 2 and the mysql version is 5.6 for connecting python django with mysql i am using the python django mysql connector which you will get easily from the mysql.org website and uh, if you are using pip you can also install it from the pip by mysql library module right so for from that library you will be able to connect the mysql database with the python or django so this is the server technology for front end it's a web application that's why i am using the html css javascript and some of the jquery library for uh, creating this project for jquery library i am using that using like form validations and the uh, creating drop down menus integration of the date plugins i am using the jquery plugins right so this is all of the technology stack which currently i'm using for developing this project right so let's start with the functionality go through so the project title is marriage hall booking system and it's a it's a web-based mini dbms my uh, mysql python and django project right so mini project because it has only and only customer functionality right there is no admin login inside the system right so let's start with the functionality go through so this is the home page of the project you can see this is a very simple home page right if you want to change the content then you can change the content directly from the html page right from the base.html or index.html this is the about page and it contains about the project if you want to change the content of this page then you can also content it from the html page this is search from where you will be able to search your hall miss marriage hall where the marriage hall is right so I am searching in the Mumbai, right? And the date is for the 15, right? So once you click on the search, you will be able to get all of the halls which is available in the Mumbai, right? So you can see, right? So this is the detail of the hall, and you will be able to see the details of the hall, right? So if you want to book this hall, just you need to log in to book the hall, right? This is a login and uh, from where you will be able to log in and you can book the hall and you can see the booking uh, hall previous booking history this is the registration this is the user registration from where from where you customer will be able to register and book the hall this is a contact this is a static contact us page i am not saving the value of this contact us page anywhere into the database and even i am not sending any type of email and sms from this page right so now i am going to log in inside the system so the login id is i think customer and test so this is the login dashboard okay so here customer can see the dashboard and search which i already uh, showed you so let me go through a booking and it and you can click on the details right so you can click on the book now so here is the book now button from where you will be able to book the hall right so this is the credit card details and it will contain the basic booking cost right that is a 50,000 which has been added by the admin and there is no need of entering the correct credit card details just enter the garbage value right I am not uh, sending the data external just it's for the reference right so once you click on the make payment you will get the booking details and you can see this is the booking details right your booking id is 12. once you click on the print receipt the same page will open into the printable format and you will you can print it right you can see all of your booking inside the my booking sections right so you can see all of the bookings here right you can see even once you click on the view receipts you can see all of the receipts here all right so yeah, here right so uh, so this is uh, let me show you again so search and search you will get all of the halls which is available in that city and you can see the details and after that you can book you can also book the hall from the previous page also right it will redact on the same page the payment page and you can enter your details and you can book the details right so this all uh, and the last thing is log out so once you log out from the system your session will be expired and the above administration menu will not be displayed let me show you once you log out then you will not be able to see the my bookings and the login uh, logout operations like that right because the session has been expired but if you log in 
then you will get all of the details here right so this all the functionalities have i have developed inside this project marriage hall booking system but if you need more functionality in this project just put it into the comment i will incorporate those changes i will make this project more better and better according to your requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest project videos on the latest technologies thanks for watching the video thank you very much thanks for watching the video thank you very much